Hello YouTubers, I'm doing a quick video on how to do the update of Lollipop and the Galaxy Note Pro 12.2. Let me show you mine right now. It's running 5.0.2 version of Lollipop. You can tell the SMP900 does the Wi-Fi version of Galaxy Note Pro 12.2 inches. So yeah, Lollipop running there. Now we're going to go to my computer and see uh, how we're going to do this manually through Odin. Okay guys, basically this is my computer. Right now I have Odin 3.9. Um, I recommend to download uh, this version of Odin um, because it's really, really um, compatible with a wide um, versions of different Samsung devices. And now this this uh, ROM over here I downloaded from sammobile.com this one over here is the version from Netherlands and this is the one I'm going to install right now through Odin um, this is the Canada version so what you need to do is go to Odin uh, I prefer to do this because it works better right click and then we go to run as administrator we go yes now you see this is the window for Odin 3.09 don't touch nothing over here just leave auto reboot and F reset time exactly like that right now it's showing that something is connected because the tablet is connected right now but now go to this box over here when it says AP go there and we're gonna try to get Adapting. So as you can tell, I have a lot of devices. I do a lot of this. So we go over here, Galaxy Note Pro 12.2, and then I'm gonna get the this one ending in C O F 4, which is Canada version. Get that one. We go to open. So we're gonna wait for a little bit, and I'm gonna cut the time over here so well the computer clear that. So here we go, guys. The clear. Sorry, it's a remote because that's because I disconnect the tablet because I need to put in download mode and I'm gonna show you how to put in download mode. So as you can tell, was checking MD5 and it successfully that means accepted the operating system I'm gonna install. So that's Odin 3.09. Okay. So after that, we're gonna go to the tablet and then we're gonna put the tablet on download version. I'm gonna try to do one hand, so be patient. Thank you. Okay, guys, this is what we're gonna do with the tablet. So we're gonna turn it off completely. Go power it off. We go power it off again. We're gonna turn off. All right. So what we're gonna do? We go over here on top. And you're gonna see power button over here, and then you're gonna see volume down, which is over here, volume up. That means minus and plus. So we're gonna press power and minus over here on top. I'm sorry, the video, if it's kind of hard. So we're gonna press these two, we're gonna hold, and we will see Samson. Oops, well, it appears just like that. So what we're going to do is volume up to continue, that means plus, as you can tell, and then we're going to go to download mode. There you go. So that's download mode. So now that it's like that, we're going to connect the tablet to the computer. Okay guys, so here's the computer, I'm um, sorry, the laptop. The computer is connected to 2.0 USB remember it's 2.0 USB not 3.0 it won't work so it's a 2.0 USB then we go to the screen and you'll see that it says added so it will come with COM11 or we'll go with another one so when that happens what we're gonna do we already have loaded the ROM and everything else so remember again I will say it before you do everything this, before you do it all this, you have to put your tablet, go to, you know, about device, 
go to build number tap on the build number five times and then get developer options then go to developer options and then you put USB debugging on after that you turn off the tablet and then you press power and the minus volume together hold it and then it will appear you know the screen that you saw before and you go volume up to set continue and we will go to download mode right there anyways so here you go so we go to start right there and you'll see the whole thing so right now it's going it's going to take a while so what I'm going to do I'm going to cut the video for a minute until it's almost done and then you'll see that it's going to say that everything is okay and then we're going to see the computer the laptop booting up again so just wait a minute as you can see, you know, the tablet is loading pretty much the new ROM. Everything looks good so far. Right now, I haven't found any routing method for the moment. But I know Chainfire is working on something. Hopefully, you can get it soon. Um, I already tried before some other ones, but didn't work. So, we're going to be waiting patiently, you know. So now you see the computer right now, still doing that. So already installed the boot image, recovery image, system image, and everything else. So it's still going right now. We can uh, I'm gonna cut the video, then we'll, I'll go back to this. Okay, guys, the process is almost done. As you can tell, you'll see there, it will say reset, okay, remove. That means everything is fine because in blue. Usually when something goes bad, it goes in red, and now you see the No Pro is rebooting right now. Starting system update. Sorry guys, I'm not a professional. I'm just doing this, you know, as a hobby. I know the video is not the best. My English is not the best. But I'm just trying to help some other people out there, you know. If you like my video, um, give thumbs up if you want to leave a or post a message if you need help just post it on my video and then I'm gonna try to answer the post as soon as possible and um, hopefully this is useful for you guys um, so as you see the no pro is booting up so I, just to be clear I went from Netherlands Netherlands version lollipop to Canada version just to do this video and well like I said I hope it's useful I'm gonna leave the links on the video you know the link for to downloading Odin 3.09 and downloading the the lollipop update Canada version for the US people um, so you can do it yourself and um, let's see okay Android is upgrading blah 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 a lot of apps so just showing you that everything is working well so optimizing app 224 so it's gonna take a while so I'm gonna cut the video over here so I hope it's hope uh, is useful for you guys and um, have a great week Take care, bye.